we're talking to West Texas Pride player Gareth Partridge, defensive tackle. You've been doing a lot to get ready for the season. Yes, sir. Can you tell us a little bit about your, your work you've been putting in? I've been going to the gym for about four months now. Uh, conditioning, doing a little bit of softball to kind of get that conditioning running up. Uh, I've gained a lot in my legs and my arms. I'm working out. I'm pushing almost 1,500 pounds on my legs. So I hope we have a good season. I'm ready for it. Yeah, you're putting in all that work, and you, and you, you worked during the day too, and then you got yes, four kids and uh, a, a very strong wife at home. Tell us a little bit about your family and the time you spent with them. I got uh, three older boys and a younger daughter, and they go 14, 13, 9, and 7. Uh, my boys all play football and soccer, and my daughter does dance and ballet. Uh, my wife stays at home, takes care of all of them, and runs around and does a lot, so she's hardly ever home too. Uh, my oldest just finished uh, middle school football, and they went undefeated. They lost one game, but they were close to being undefeated. And my oldest boy just finished GMFL, third place in the Super Bowl, and now he's playing for Select Oiler. And they're ready for the season to start, too, to be down on the field with the guys. And my daughter's excited to be down there and run around, too. Yeah, it sounds like we've got some future pride players there. But uh, you, you were telling me a little bit about some of the great mission work that, that you've been in part of in, in the past and your wife's been a part of, too. Can you, can you tell us a little bit about that, that work you've done in Ethiopia? Yes, we do uh, help uh, because of Kennedy Charity, and it's uh, building a school and a church and helping a lot of the families down there to uh, learn how to get a job based on how to take care of their family, provide for them, and gives them an education. The kids get a, three meals a day to go down there, and they go learn at school for eight hours to 12 hours. They get to stay in a combine that kind of keeps them safe until they get to go home with their parents. Um, we went down there and spent two weeks kind of checking it out, helped build the school, the church, and then played with the kids. And then we also sponsor a, a family down there. We got two twins and their mom, which we helped them so they can go to school and uh, get the food and the needs to start a business to, to provide for their own family to make it better for them. All right, Gareth, thank you, and we look forward to seeing you during the season. Thank you.